It's Miracles Today with Billy Burke. Coming from Ruth Eckerd Hall in Clearwater, Florida, Billy Burke was healed of terminal brain cancer at a very early age at a Catherine Kuhlman service. Ms. Kuhlman called him out on the balcony, and when she touched him with the power of God, the cancer was completely gone. Today, Pastor Billy is taking that same healing power of God to the nations. Lord, no pain. No pain! I can see my dad. Oh. I can see. I have my voice back, and I am cancer free. Thank you. Amazing, I'll tell you, God is amazing. And the more that you talk to Him, the more that you look to Him. Sometimes I just say to myself, Lord, I'm looking to you because there's so many chattering voices down here. I mean, everybody out there has their opinion, their thoughts, their way of doing things, what, what they heard, what they read, what they saw on the internet. I mean, it's, it's, a, it's a mixed bag, you know? It's a montage of madness. And I tell you what, I have to fight to make sure that every day, Lord, I'm looking to you. I'm looking to you. And so with my mouth, I cancel out all of the distraction. I cancel out everything. Not that a lot of these people aren't precious. Not that they don't count. It's just that in times whenever I need to have a breakthrough, I don't need to hear people's opinions. I need to hear truth. And that truth has to come from him, either by way of him speaking to me spirit to spirit, or by way of his written word or by people that he's speaking through that, you know, have a grasp, you know, of that prophetic moment. You need to hear truth as well. And I pray that in these next 25, 30 minutes that you're gonna hear truth, feel truth, and that something is gonna break inside of you today. And I'll tell you what, you are gonna be feeling pretty different here in, in, in a very short window of time. Oh, is God ever good. We've got some great, great footage to show you today of people being wonderfully touched by the power of God. Let's go see it right now. I was born incapable of getting ear or uh, air to my inner ear, so the, the three bones are uh, worn down. Stay here. And my uh, my options are uh, either live with it or get an ear, a hearing aid. So you you can hear what a little bit? Just a little. Bit. How little? Um, I'd say about 30 30 percent. So this ear's okay. Yes. That ear's bad. Right. Have you been prayed for with this? Has it been? Have you gotten prayers? I've, I've asked friends to play, pray for me, yes. And what happened? Um, nothing, well, nothing so far, but <laughs> I'm expecting. It softened the ground for what's going to happen tonight. Yes, absolutely. Amen. Okay. Thank yes. them for their prayers, okay? Amen. So what do you want to do with your life? Um... <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> what? Um... I'd, I'd like to, uh, I mean... Don't make nothing up now. I know. <laughs> what um, would you like to do? I, I like to fix problems. I like to fix stuff. So I, I like working with... Oh, my. Hold on. What? Uh, it's, 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 it's popping. It popped open! What do you think of this? Um, I've never, I've never, it's never been this good ever in my life, ever. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Don't you ever forget this. I was expecting to be healed, but like, I was not expecting that. <laughs> wow. Come on, church! Come on, give that praise, come on! Uh, 
used to be a uh, enforcer for the Pagan Motorcycle Club, a drug abuser and a drug addict. I've been coming here for a couple years off and on. My mother's come up here and got many prayer for me and she wore out many a rug praying for me. And uh, you told her one night that the devil no longer has a hold on me. Praise God he does not. Uh, I am no longer pagans no more. I'm no longer a drug addict. You were part of the pagans? For 15 years. Oh. The only way to get out is if you die or go to jail. And I already went to jail, and the Lord has a plan for me, and he ain't letting me die. <laughs> Praise God. Praise the Father. So your mother came here for you? Many a time. And the word to her was, your son is being delivered? He knew that the devil no longer has a hold. No on longer him. has a hold. Right. See, I'm, 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 I'm interested, I'm interested in the journey of that prophetic word. I'm interested in when did it break in you? Was it, what was the timing on that? The timing was uh, after I went to prison for a second time, I got out and became uh, heavily used in drugs. And what was the wake up call? What, what was the wake up call? When I couldn't do it, control my life no more. I just asked God to take over. And from that day forward until today, I haven't looked back once. I haven't touched drugs. I haven't been part of the pagans. And the Lord's been blessing me every single day. Come on, somebody! Oh, my God! Oh! Boy, pie the Holy Ghost. Pie the Holy Ghost. Pie the Holy Ghost. Oh, somebody give God a shout! You watch today's broadcast of Miracles Today with Billy Burke, this powerful healing signal that's being broadcast to millions of people all over the world. Our prayer partners are standing by to pray for you. Call now and speak to someone who wants to pray for you to receive all that God has for you today. Call 844-A-MIRACLE. That's 844 and the letters A-MIRACLE. Call now. You know, it's always amazing when God begins to move, that Holy Spirit, I'll tell you, whether you're in a car, at a home, in a church, whatever, and, and, and you begin to experience it's, uh, the touch of God, it's so important that you respond. Listen to me, that you respond to Him. Acknowledge, oh Lord, thank you for that. Yeah, Lord, I, I receive, I receive. Don't just, don't just say, well, I sure hope He did something. Acknowledge that He did. What if you don't feel anything? Then you say, by faith, thank you. By faith, I thank you. If you feel it, then you say, oh, Lord, I thank you that you left me experience that wonderful touch. But acknowledge him. Just the same way people acknowledge pain. They acknowledge cancer. They acknowledge my arm is swelling. I don't feel good. People are always acknowledging the negative. But after God moves into you right now, after I mean, there, there's just a gully washer coming your way rivers of life hitting in your direction. And I'm believing that long after this broadcast is over, throughout the day and the evening and tomorrow, this has some, this is going to continue. This is perpetual. He's after to make you well to have full recovery. Just stop wherever you are and say, Lord, I receive. I, I receive that. Thank you, Lord. And what will happen is he'll begin to release more and more and more of his personal presence in your life. Oh, that's so wonderful. I'm so glad we're together on Miracles today. Write me, let me know what you, how you enjoy the broadcast. Call the number, get some prayer right now. Got a special guest today. I'll tell you what, who is this special guest today? Pastor, we have Lily today. Lily. Good to meet you. Uh, tell me now, you were, you were healed. Uh, a Christian retreat. At the Christian retreat in On Brandon. February 2nd, yes. And that was this year? This year. Just a, a month ago. Yeah, that's right. And tell me, what was you healed of? Well, I had uh, terrible memories from the trauma of abuse in my childhood. Oh. And uh, I didn't even know, I went down under the power of the Spirit. I did not remember anything that happened. Mm. That, that whole time. Just, really? Yeah, the whole time that I was down under the All power, the I didn't remember anything. Not a single thing. You mean what happened that night? And that night, nothing. I didn't. I didn't know what was going on. I was completely out. Usually, when I go down, we have gone down before. I could hear what was going on. I had. I could hear nothing. 
And then uh, I had gone up because I needed a healing for cartilage. Yes. Yeah, but after the service, my husband brought me home and I had no memories of the abuse that I had suffered in my childhood. It took about five or six in the morning. And, my, and I felt, my mind felt clear, like a clear blue sky. So this is an emotional healing. Emotional healing, and 61 years. You were abused as a child. As a child. And this was from your father. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. And that had to be a horrible, that you lived with all those years. Uh, and not only that, I've been working with the Lord to try and heal, restore my soul. Mm -hmm. But uh, I was getting frustrated mm -hmm. because I've been working all these years mm -hmm. and there was no finality to it. And then no closure. No closure. But it's closed now. It's closed now. It's closed now. <laughs> oh, and so, is your father still living? No, he's not. He's passed. He's passed and he's in heaven. Mm. Praise God. You're happy for that. Yes. And uh, this had to be like a, like the old expression, like a, an elephant getting off of you or well, that's a gorilla, right. a gorilla, something that just, I mean, that had to be a form of deliverance as well. Yes. Well, I mean, I can You were remember. tormented. You were tormented. Oh, uh, well, yes. I had to pray in tongues for an hour every morning before I got up oh. just to survive the day. It was that bad. It was that bad. Yes. And so you would see your father, you would see the picture, you would see him whenever the torment would. No, it was just so much. My father was an alcoholic. There was so much stuff, mm -hmm. unbelievable stuff mm -hmm. in my life. So now I have memories, but I have no toxic, painful memories <gasps> at all, nothing. People, this is absolutely amazing because, you know, memories, I mean, your mind is like a computer. Either you have it in conscious state or it's in cold storage. And to be able to, to remember and not remember the pain that the poison's taken out. That's right. Only God can do that. That's right. Our hospitals are filled with overly medicated people because we don't know how to deal with that subconscious or that soul part of man. You know, I, I, I am a spirit, I have a soul, I live in a body. Come on, say that I am a spirit. You know, I have a soul, I live in a body. You're, you're, th you're a triune being. Mankind is a triune, animals are body and soul. We have a spirit. And you were damaged deep in that inner part. So I could not believe it. I even today have trouble understanding all the things the Lord has dealt with, the consequences I suffered from it. Mm. He has been my counselor. I, I, I can't even comprehend. It's been horrendous. So Lily, this was like a 50-year problem, a 60-year problem, or what? Well, it was a long time. It's, it's been a long time. I'm 70. You're 70. I'm 70. And so now you feel like you're, you're a bird out of a cage. You That's feel. right, yeah. Yeah, now I've got a new life. I've got victory. <laughs> yes, and I want to share with others so that they're free. Mm. I want freedom for other people. You're going you're gonna to be used mightily by the Holy Spirit. You know, there's such a purity in you, Lily, an integrity. Jesus has seen me through it all. Through yeah. it all. Amazing. Mm -hmm. All these years, Amazing. by his grace, I'm still alive. And healed. Yes. <laughs> I tell you, God's good. You know, right now there's a song going to be sung to you, and I believe it's going to bless you immensely. Let's go hear this wonderful healing music. When walking by the sea, come and follow me, Jesus called. Then all through Galilee, the sick and the diseased, changed his power is just the same as when he walked the shore this god of yesterday is still the healing jesus now and evermore what a healing jesus I have found in 
today's broadcast of Miracles Today with Billy Burke, this powerful healing signal that's being broadcast to millions of people all over the world. Our prayer partners are standing by to pray for you. Call now and speak to someone who wants to pray for you to receive all that God has for you today. Call 844-A-MIRACLE. That's 844 and the letters A-MIRACLE. Call now. Yes, how are you tonight? Okay, but I want to say that you, same thing that happened to another woman with a long black hair. You said you called out a healing to atrial fibrillation. I came in really for a prayer for my son, but it never happened. That way you called out the healing for me. And I went under the power, and I, I had my eyes closed, and I, and I opened them up, and you were leaning over me, and I'm saying, are you talking to me? And you said, yes, I'm trying to tell you that God is widening the arteries <gasps> of your heart. Oh! The blood flow through there. Wow. So I've been here several times since, but my heart doctor took a, uh, a, a Doppler test on my okay. heart artery. He said there's minimal blockages there. Minimal! Now, no, we got none. But I'm also here because you told me to bring my son, and I did. You brought him. Yeah, no, he brought himself here. He's over there. Come on over here, son. Come on, young man. <laughs> oh, my. He's here. <laughs> How are you? After I get my hand back, I'm all right. <laughs> what are you doing with that? Get away. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Wow. How you doing? How are you? I'm all right. How are you? Doing good. Good. Nice to see you. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I'm only kidding you, Pastor. I'm only kidding. It's good to see you. He Enjoy was, this. tell him what you, he was in the, the biker gang, the pagans. He was, your title was the enforcer. Yeah, I was a sergeant at arms. Sergeant of arms. And uh, I was a bad guy. For how many years did you ride 13. with him? Thirteen years. Yeah. And tell them the pagans now are the, are the hell's angels of the East Coast, right? Uh, well, I mean, it doesn't matter who they are. They're just bad people. It's a bad organization. You want no parts of it. I don't want no parts of it. Thank God I'm not. So how did you get out and, and live to tell? The how story? did I get out? <laughs> I mean, well, you don't get out. You don't just walk away from it. I, I'm under the grace of God. I'm under the blood of Jesus. And, and the protection of Jesus. You know, well, see, you, you were still in it, though. 
when she would come to meetings. Oh, well, she... <laughs> she would come to meetings every month, this precious mother, and she would say, pray for my son. He's in a biker gang. da 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 da, -da. And she would tell me the gang. And when she told me who the gang was, I thought, oh, well, Lord, you're going to have to really make it a major miracle to get him out of that gang. And, and she would come, I don't know how long, a couple years. They had a terrible fight up there in New York, and he was put in jail for three years. But look, she's but, pretty good at but this. But her prayers, her prayers brought you to that tent in Murraysville. You know, well, that brought me yeah, there. But yeah. you were saying before about laying a cloth. Yeah, yeah. Okay, how the yeah. disciples would just take a piece of cloth and lay it on so. <laughs> she used to take my colors, and as a, as a, a member of that organization, our colors were just... You wouldn't let them touch the ground, just like a flag. All right, you wouldn't let no one touch them or anything like that. You'd be fighting somebody. I mean, it was just, you know, you lived for them. And she, uh, <laughs> she took them. She took my shirts and she was, you brought them to the altar? I laid them on the, on, on the in front of the altar for deliverance. He said, anybody has a picture of someone, anybody has an and he was in that gang, and I laid them on the altar. I said, it was pagan, said pagan on it. There he is today. For, Look at this, people. That was greater works. Uh, give God a big, give, give God a big. You know, the Holy Spirit can't heal what he can't touch. He can't heal what he can't touch. And he can't touch what's not brought out into the light for him to see. You know, so much people, because we're so ashamed of so many things that happen in our lives, and we get forgiven of it, but we don't get cleansed of it. And 1 John 1, 9 says that he's able to both forgive and cleanse, and a lot of that begins by bringing it out into the light, beginning to bring it out into the light of God, say, oh, Lord, this happened to me. This is a real part of my life. I'm ashamed of all of this. You know, I'm not that person anymore. Whatever you have to say. And when that comes out into the light, that healing touch of the Master comes on that and just begins to do what happened to Lily. What happened to Lily can happen to many of you that are watching the broadcast today, tonight, wherever the time zone this is being shown in. He's a healing Jesus. He's not a condemning Jesus. You know, and people are always asking, what, what can I do? What can I do? Bring it out and hold it before Him and say, dear Jesus, dear Holy Spirit, Dear Father God, touch. He's touching many of you. We give you praise, Jesus. Touch your people. Touch your people. Her disc herniations being wonderfully healed. Disc herniation being wonderfully healed. There's lymphoma. Hodgkin's lymphoma being wonderfully touched by the healing power of God. We give you praise. There's a candida being healed. A yeast infection being flushed. There's a urinary tract infection, infection being flushed. We give you praise. There's a brain tumor in a young boy being touched, being wonderfully healed by the mighty, mighty power. Someone named Robin being completely healed by the power. Robin, call the number on the screen. See you in a meeting. See you somewhere real, real soon or back here on the program. Until I see you, remember, all things, everything is possible with God. Many love the Lord and desire to walk with Him closer each day, but yet seem to continuously struggle with the same sins or bondages over and over. If that describes you or someone you know, Billy Burke has a new two-part teaching series titled Soul Cleanse Just For You. 1 John 1, 9 in the Bible says that God is faithful to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. In this series, Billy Burke explains how God has made provision for us to not only receive our forgiveness, but also to receive our complete cleansing as well. Get a hold of this. I believe it'll change your life and get you on the road, not just to healing, but to a wholeness maybe you've never, ever experienced. For a gift of $20 to the ministry, Billy Burke is making this valuable two-part series available to you. To receive your copy of Soul Cleanse, please go to billyburke.org. This series could revolutionize your life. Pastor Billy's World Outreach website is a wonderful tool designed just for you, no matter what you're going through. You'll see many things that will greatly help you, like Pastor Billy's Word of the Week. Just click on the triangle and enjoy a special word that's new every week. Or go over to the Miracles Today window where you can watch past shows or enjoy the most recent Miracles Today broadcast. It's Miracles Today with Billy Burke. You can also visit the Crusade itinerary window and see when Pastor Billy will be in your area again. 
There's so much to experience like what to do when you are beginning your healing experience. You can encourage your faith by clicking on the Miracle Theater, which documents God's amazing healing power through the many lives that forever were changed through this ministry. And you can pick up valuable resources that will help you gain a stronger walk with the Lord, a more powerful faith life, and receive the amazing breakthrough that you're believing for. Why not visit BillyBurke.org after the broadcast and just take a look around. You'll be glad you did. With all of life's noise and distraction, it's a challenge to maintain an atmosphere of healing peace. That's why Pastor Billy has created Healing Scriptures from the Psalms. The anointing flowing through this CD can break through all the noise and clutter and carry you to that precious secret place with our Lord Jesus. Healing Scriptures from the Psalms features selected passages in the book of Psalms that Pastor Billy has chosen specifically to help create that atmosphere of healing peace in your life. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and forget not all of his benefits, who forgiveth all thine iniquities, and who healeth all of thy diseases. The world-class background music track is from Roby Tulak, who at a tender age was exposed to and influenced by the music in the Catherine Kuhlman ministry. Call now or go online to order your copy of Healing Scriptures from the Psalms. Your life may never be the same. Join hands with Billy Burke as he takes the miracle healing power of God around the world. Your prayers and financial support to this ministry can make all the difference. Your gift is so appreciated. Please visit BillyBurke.org or in the U.S. write Billy Burke World Outreach, P.O. Box 25441, Tampa, Florida, 33622 or call 888, the number 7 and the word HEALED. In Canada, please visit touchingtoronto.com or write to Touching Toronto in care of Selwyn Outreach Centre, 2686 Lakefield Road, Selwyn, Ontario, K9J6X5.